Hi again! If you'd like a refresher on this particular topic, you can check out my earlier rundown. Though to put it simply, the Undiscovered West is a region labelled on the second officially released map of Equestria, appearing as either a land bridge or a peninsula. The reason it's considered so mysterious is there are very few maps of the region that actually feature such a landscape, with some instead including an island and others showing nothing but coastline. So why am I bringing this up? Well, about a month ago, the commenter Jack Kemp brought up an even earlier possible sighting from the episode Freezer Crowd. In said episode, Discord leads Twilight and Cadence to the, quote, edge of Equestria, the map he uses depicting a massive stretch of land leading westward. It's also worth noting that Discord's own directions <coughs> You want to head north? Turn left to oh. seem to lead towards the northwest, meaning their journey could well have taken them to said land formation. This naturally raises some questions, namely, does this map actually depict the Undiscovered West? If it does, then did the three characters actually visit there? Have we really seen what the Undiscovered West looks like? Well, given the limited evidence either way, I'll refrain from speculating too much on the matter. Here's what we do know. Said feature fits the shape of both the Undiscovered West and the Frozen North, thus it could plausibly be either. The map includes both roads, paths and possible settlements. While there's potential evidence of old railways on the second official map near the Undiscovered West, it's not concrete and doesn't entirely fit with Discord's map. Though quick note, there's even less evidence for railways in the Frozen North. Regarding whether Discord could have brought the characters there, it's possible his directions were designed to be purposefully confusing, with little actual relation to the intended destination. However, even if we presume he did take them there, the biomes still don't really seem to match, the edge of Equestria looking much more like the Badlands than the western coast. Though another quick note, the desolate town of the Hollow Shades appears in the same area, yet looks very much like what we saw in Freezer Crowd, meaning there could still be a connection. The land we see also includes giant flora in the form of an oversized flower, possibly aligning with the giant tree-like structures on the Friendship map. Unfortunately, we never see those trees in the episode, leaving the connection ambiguous. As far as I can tell, this is the first time any possible depictions of the Undiscovered West appear chronologically speaking, even older than the second official release. As of now, that's all we really have to go on. The only two theories I've been able to come up with are either A, Discord himself created the Undiscovered West to mess with Twilight by connecting an island to the mainland, or B, the region is low-lying and especially susceptible to sea level changes. Either way, it's pretty hard to say whether or not the map actually shows the Undiscovered West. At the very least, it does give us more to work with. Thank you very much to Jack Kemp for pointing this one out, and to everyone watching, let me know if you have any thoughts on the matter.